let's talk about the common trope of pain-killing medicine known as non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. These drugs have been shown to increase your risk of having a heart attack. You probably know these drugs more by their common names such as ibuprofen, Advil, Aleve, Celebrex, Voltaren. There's hundreds of them. However, you may not know that they increase your risk of having a heart attack within a week of starting to take them. The association of heart disease and non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs has been known for many years. The drug Vioxx was taken off the market and is no longer available because of the risk of having a heart attack associated with it. Unfortunately, many people don't understand what the risk of cardiovascular disease really is. And they take these medicines sort of routinely whenever they get a headache, a simple muscle ache or pain. You should talk to your doctor about your risk so that when you take these drugs for pain, you understand what you're doing to your body. For the average person with no cardiovascular risk who takes a very low dose and doesn't take them very often or for very long, this is probably not significant. But for a person who's had a heart attack, for a person who already has high blood pressure, you need to know that your risk of a heart attack can go up anywhere from 24% to 58%, depending upon the non-steroidal you're taking within a week of taking the drug you may want to consider using a simple other method for controlling pain if your pain is not really severe. Think about alternating heat and ice. Think about a soothing tea such as chamomile. Think about, I know this sounds strange, but getting up and moving. In people with arthritis is well known that just moving helps control pain. The bottom line is, before you blindly reach for a painkiller such as a non-steroidal, you should talk to your doctor and you should know what your risk of a heart attack is before you use this method for simple pain control. Thank you. I hope you found this useful.